crazy. So, you know. Yeah, I hear that. I hear that. I, uh, I've only been here a couple of times so far. You are at it today. Today's going to be a little bit crazy, a little bit different. We're not out in the wild picking, but we are telling you guys about something very important here today. So if you guys missed our last video at the flea market, I'll put it right up top there. If you guys want to watch that before you watch this video or after you watch this video, it's up to you. But during that pick at the flea market, we did find a milk glass mug. And I'll put that right up top there for you all to take a look at. Uh, it is currently listed right now for $101.49. It already has two watchers on it. Uh, so that kind of inspired me. It reminded me about how much value can be found in milk glass coffee mugs, specifically vintage advertising milk glass mugs. So what we're going to do today is, is I'm going to show you guys a bunch of different vintage milk glass advertising mugs. And then while we show them to you on the screen, you will also see how much they have sold for. Now, all of these comps I'm pulling today and showing you on the screen are from Worth Point because that's kind of where I get a majority of my information from. If you guys aren't using Worth Point, you guys can check it out. There's a link in the description below. They do have a free trial. You guys are more than welcome to use that free trial. I use Worth Point every single day. Um, as you can see, I'm using it for this video, uh, but you can also use, find some of these sold comps, um, the more recent ones on, uh, eBay, all of these, uh, mugs have sold within the last couple of years, some this year, some last year, some, you know, two years ago, some of them are going to be super rare and then you might not ever find them, but a lot of times what you can do is you can use the information that I'm about ready to give you and, and utilize that information when you're out looking for uh vintage advertising milk glass coffee mugs what's really cool though about this is no matter what you pick like say you don't deal with glass and you don't deal with vintage right say you're a clothing reseller a vintage clothing reseller a lot of that same sort of mentality that you're using for vintage clothing applies here on vintage milk glass mugs. Sounds crazy, I know, but you're gonna see a couple examples. Same thing if you're out buying video games. Once again, I'm gonna have an example of where a video game buyer might recognize a vintage milk glass coffee mug worth tons of money. Uh, it, it's a lot of the same sort of things that you're looking for, no matter what type of stuff you're reselling, that you can utilize towards vintage milk glass coffee mugs i say it so slow because i'm trying to make sure i say the same like <laughs> order of words each time but ladies and gentlemen let's go ahead and jump right into it this is going to be in no particular order because i don't know if i, I don't necessarily want to show you like the big bang ones first and i don't want to start from the cheapest one all the way expensive one we're just going to throw them all out there at you guys so you make sure you stay tuned throughout the entire video because you do not want to miss these mugs uh we will go through them fairly quickly just to make things a little bit easier on the viewers we don't want you to have to sit through 30 minutes because you all know i can talk for hours upon hours upon hours i've already probably been talking too long for some of you but without further ado let's jump right into it first mug we're going to look at is actually a mug that i have sold personally this is a vintage stuckey's coffee cup coffee club mug okay now you're going to find different makers on all these milk glass mugs. You're going to find Anchor Hawking. You're going to find Hazel Atlas. You're going to find Federal Glass. And you may even find some Glass Bake or some unmarked ones, okay? But we're looking at the subject, the theme on the mug. That is what's really going to drive the prices of these. So this particular mug I found once before. Uh, I got it doing a house clean out and I knew nothing about it, but I picked it up because it was old vintage advertising milk glass coffee mug. I think I sold mine for around 100, 150 or 125. The one that was showing you up on the screen sold for a hundred and seventy dollars. Just imagine selling a mug because easy to store, easy to ship. 
great profit value. A lot of these things, you, a lot of these mugs you could probably find for dirt cheap, depending on where you find them, whether it's at the flea market, an estate sale, a yard sale, church sale, doesn't matter. These are, these are items that you could probably find anywhere that you're picking or sourcing. All right, up next. Now remember, this is all vintage advertising. Food. How about a Pizza Hut? Pizza Hut. This is one's made by Anchor Hawking. Pizza Hut restaurant milk glass advertising coffee mug. This mug sold for $237.50. Holy smokes. So once again, big bold advertising. Now, obviously, one thing that you do want to take into consideration is the um how the condition. So the condition of the graphic is super important. Um, whenever you're dealing with sort of milk glass Pyrex, for example, one of the biggest disappointments is when you find a really nice Pyrex bowl and it has dishwasher damage. So sometimes these might be faded graphics or the paint's gone. So you that will affect the value. Now, don't necessarily be like, don't pick it up because it's not perfect. Because if it's a super rare mug, even if it has imperfections, it can still fetch tons of money. So this... Pizza Hut mug sold for $237.50, ladies and gentlemen. Up next, let's move around a little bit here. Let's, uh, let me find something. Okay, this is an interesting one because this one has some color to it. It's not all white, okay? We're going to get into some different color milk glass pieces. This is a vintage Lee, like Lee that made shirts and jeans and all that stuff vintage lee brand advertising you notice advertising is killer word to use in these titles and descriptions if you find these items and you decide to sell them this vintage lee brand advertising milk glass mug made by federal glass sold for 99 dollars 99 okay so we're talking once again easy to store easy to ship if you guys have any questions on how to ship a mug can always check out one of our shipping videos. We'll guide you on how we ship breakables, no problem. Sold for $99.99, okay? Now, let's move into another colored one. This is a red milk glass, Captain Crunch cereals. Now, if you see something vintage advertising, something like this, this is gonna pop out at you. This is a big red mug. Do not walk by it, pick it up and run. This particular vintage anchor hawking Captain Crunch cereal advertising milk glass coffee mug sold for $315. Now, there are multiple examples of this one selling, so it's not a one-off necessarily. There are multiple ones out there that have sold for high dollar amounts. Fantastic. Up next, McDonald's. You will see a lot of McDonald's um milk glass mugs not all of them are going to be a hundred dollar plus mugs okay now think about this there's you we've talked about vintage hats before tons okay and if you look at some of the most high-end vintage trucker hats okay snapback trucker hats three stripes you know the slice uh some of the other ones they're from they have like cities attached to them or they're like a random gas station in the middle of nowhere with a city attached to it. Because people like those rarity items. It's, it's a very specific uh, location or name attached to a bigger name company. In this example, McDonald's Jackson. Okay, so I'm assuming Jackson is probably a city because it has a radio station attached to it. This was a pair of mugs. Uh, made by Fire King. For those of you that don't know, Fire King is Anchor Hawking. This pair of McDonald's mugs sold for $300. $300 for the pair. So even if you found one, you're looking at $150, okay? Up next, Coca-Cola. Everybody knows Coca-Cola sells, right? Especially vintage Coca-Cola and milk glass Coca-Cola. I have sold a milk glass change tray, vanity tray, uh, serving tray. I don't even remember what it was, exactly what it was, but it was probably about this big. Sold for a couple hundred bucks in, to Japan. This is a Anchor Hawking Coca-Cola advertising milk glass mug. It sold for $159.99. Okay. Up next, 
We all know gas stuff sells, oil stuff sells, hats, signs, all that sort of stuff. How about a milk glass mug? This is a vintage shell oil advertising mug. This one is not very flashy, but you could, the, the uniqueness to the, the logo on the cup is fantastic. This sold for $133.50. Okay, computers, all my people out here who are, might be watching this and you're an electronics seller. IBM, you find old school IBM, you're picking it up. Even a vintage t-shirt seller, you find a vintage IBM t-shirt, you're picking it up, a hat, anything. This is a vintage Anchor Hawking IBM coffee mug. Once again, you see it has that city name attached to it, Lexington. This sold for $94. So it, it's, it's insane. This is a one that I kind of threw in here because this is a good example of where something like not a big name company um, may sell for crazy money, may not. This is a vintage Red Owl food stores. If you know what Red Owl food stores are, drop a comment uh, below. Let me know because I'd never heard of Red Owl food stores before. This is a grocery store advertising milk glass mug. This one was two-sided. Uh, it sold for $86, okay? Here's another cool one. Speaking of food and a colored one, this one is yellow, yellow milk glass. This is made by Federal it is bunny bread vintage advertising coffee mug sold for 78 dollars this one right here is crazy car stuff we all know if you pick up old car stuff for some resellers they might sell vintage uh, car manuals you know vintage uh, repair manuals for cars we all love cars on our t-shirts cars on our hats car parts Look at this. This is a vintage Anchor Hawking 20 years of Mustang. So this came out in the 1980s. Milk glass mug. This mug, once again, this one has sold multiple times for $400. $400 this vintage milk glass coffee mug, vintage advertising sold for $400. One more time. This vintage milk glass coffee cup sold for four hundred dollars absolutely insane ladies and gentlemen this is another one where it's kind of like it's unique it stands out it pops out at you baseball sports we all know vintage sports sells well this is a vintage minnesota twins baseball milk glass souvenir mug this one sold for three hundred and sixty six dollars and ten cents crazy this is getting out of hand how about mickey mouse disney i mean we all know this is another one all of these you gotta remember not every single one is going to be a 300 dollar mug some are going to be produced more than others but if you can get them at a good price it's worth the homework okay this is a disney mickey mouse and donald duck baseball fire king vintage milk glass coffee cup it sold for three hundred and fifty dollars oh my gosh earlier we were talking about vintage clothing right everybody knows harley davidson sells right sell a harley shirt a harley jacket harley hat harley pants harley's memorabilia how about a vintage harley davidson milk glass coffee mug that sold for two hundred and ninety nine dollars ladies and gentlemen um this is i mean we could go on and on and on and on i'm just giving you some quick hitters right here how about snoopy red baron fire king milk glass vintage 349 dollars for this mug i'm telling you i'm telling you how many times have you all probably walked by these I know a lot of people out there probably walk up to a yard sale and they say, hey, do you have any video games? They say no. And then what do you do? You leave. Don't do that. Don't be that guy because they might have one of these. How about a vintage 1981 Donkey Kong Milky Milky <laughs> Donkey Kong Milk Glass Coffee Mug. This one was made by Glass Bake. Sold for $275. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm telling you, this is, stuff is insane. It's oh, everybody loves Burger King, right? 
Vintage advertising, milk glass, coffee mug, Burger King. How much? It sold for $335. Ladies and gentlemen, $335. Okay, once again, not every Burger King mug is going to sell for $335. But there are some Burger King coffee mugs out there that will sell for that much money. And ladies and gentlemen, we're going to round it out. Okay, we're going to round it out with the one that hopefully you saw in the thumbnail and you clicked on this video and you said, I want to know more. I want to know more about vintage milk glass coffee mugs. I want to know more about vintage advertising milk glass coffee mugs that sell for hundreds of dollars. And ladies and gentlemen, that is the Chevron vintage advertising milk glass Chevron service sells you see it has the low the motto on there coffee mug sold for 419 dollars ladies and gentlemen 419 dollars now if you guys missed that last video i talked about it in that video this is why i pick up vintage milk glass advertising mugs if I if it's something that I know, also this is like I was trying to tell you. If you're a reseller, if it's something that you already know sells, use that to your advantage. If you see it on a milk glass coffee mug, buy it. Most of the time, these mugs are two dollars, five dollars. You know, I mean, shoot, if you saw that mug for ten bucks, you'd probably still buy it now, knowing that it sold for four hundred and nineteen dollars. So hopefully. My goal is always is that my enthusiasm, my energy, my love for this sort of stuff comes through to you through this screen and you feel it and you have learned something now and now you're excited. You're excited. You're ready to jump out there. Go on Saturday. Go on Friday for those lucky people who have yard sales on Thursdays. Keep your eyes wide open. Look out for these vintage advertising milk glass coffee mugs. You will not regret it. So hopefully you all enjoyed this video. Hopefully you guys learned something. We appreciate all the love and all the support. We're going to be trying to crank out some more videos here on the Over the Years YouTube channel. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Don't forget to hit that thumbs up. Click the bell too. That way you get notified every time we put out a new video. You don't have to worry about missing a video. You know, make sure you guys are following us on Instagram too. Big shout out to all my guys over at the Reseller Information Network. If you guys aren't subscribed to that channel, make sure you subscribe. Also, you guys can find us at the One Stop Shop over on District. You can find all the links for all of these things in the description below. But most importantly, YouTube, stay classy. Peace.